Welcome home, child. What news? Another of the named is put to rest. Then it would appear your work is nearly complete, and your status restored. A question, Master, if I may. Ask, and I will answer. Why these men, Jubayer and Sabrand? Ah, don't you see? They paved the way for change. Ensure threats both old and new are not given cause to intervene. To weaken them is to weaken our enemy. I suppose that makes sense. Were these men to continue their work, our work would quickly be undone. How is that? We've caused them much grief. We strike at the arms, yes. But this is a Hydra that you face, and it is quick to replace that which is severed. Then we should lop off its head and be done with this. Soon, soon. We are close. Only one more man stands between us and our ultimate goal. I will return to my work. The sooner this last man dies, the sooner I might face our true enemy. Before you go, I have a question for you. Of course. What is the truth? We place faith in ourselves. We see the world the way it really is, and hope that one day all mankind might see the same. What is the world, then? An illusion. One which we can either submit to, as most do, or transcend. What is it to transcend? To recognize nothing is true and everything is permitted. That laws arise not from divinity but reason. I understand now that our creed does not command us to be free. It commands us to be wise. Do you see now why the Templars are a threat? Whereas we would dispel the illusion, they would use it to rule. Yes, to reshape the world in an image more pleasing to them. That is why I sent you to steal their treasure. That is why I keep it locked away. And that is why you kill them. So long as even one survives, so too does their desire to create a new world order. Take your equipment. Seek out this last man. With his death, Robert de Sable will at last be vulnerable. It will be done. Safety and peace upon you, Altair. Well, that's some true wisdom there by Altair. Finally figured out this creed and understanding. By which he can now move forward and develop it further. We're almost fully upgraded back to a ma rank of Master Assassin. Just one more assassin to kill, and then all the sins in our way is Robert de Sable. Well, Aker, this is about how I'd always expect to enter your depressing cesspool of death. And I must say, I'd like to say, it's uh, been wonderful. And I'm going to miss you as a city after this assassination, but I, I can't say that, because you could be the number one worst, most depressing city I've ever seen in my entire life. You are a ruin. You are dark and dreary at all times. Your missions here revolve around plague, doctors of death, corrupt politicians and political leaders, and all in all, just horrible people in a horrible place that want nothing but death. So, I can't wait, in fact, to never have to be in this city ever again. And I can't wait to finish this assassination. Greetings, Altair. What news? Al Muallim has named another. Calls himself Sabrand. I am familiar with the man. Newly appointed leader of the Knights Teutonic, he resides in the Venetian Quarter and runs Akka's port. I'll start my work at once. Here are the places where you should focus your search. Oh, God, On the docks east of here, among the ships and their crews. At the chapel to the northeast, near the cross overlooking the port. And to the north, in front of St. John's Gate. This is most helpful. My thanks for the guidance. Altair. Yes, Rafi. I owe you an apology. For what? For doubting your dedication to our cause. No, it was I who erred. I believe myself above the creed. You owe me nothing. As you wish, my friend. Go in safety. A 
was about to say, like the city, Rafiq, you're the most... Oh, you're not Rafiq. Who are you? I don't even know your name. You're the most bland... Are you Rafiq? Isn't Leonardo Rafiq? I don't know. Fucking, you're just like the city, bland and uninteresting as a character. Um, heading the right way? I am heading the right way. Because the port is where I should be going. And the port is south? Or oh, no, it's this way. This is the direction I want to be going. In fact, this viewpoint's place I want to be going. Oh, that hurt a lot. Ah, my favorite pickpocketing. Simple and extremely easy. He's done. We moved the last of the food cells onto his ship this morning. How much is there? Enough for several weeks. What's he planning, I wonder? Perhaps he intends to flee. Something's got him very scared. Anyway, I must be off. He asked I deliver a letter to a courier at St. John's Gate. I best not keep him waiting. I don't care! Go away! I'm trying to steal from this man. Oh, and I nailed it again, as usual, as per usual. If this beggar would fuck off already, god damn it. Did they let you into the city or did you fight your way in? Oh, perhaps I should be more respectful, as I myself now require your help. I spent too much time in the harbor brothel last night and insulted a Teutonic knight's wife, or so I am told. Now there is a group of them after me. Could you give me a hand or a blade? If you return before I leave the city, I will give you the benefit of my wisdom. <sighs> okay, this time I have hidden blade selected. <laughs> yep, I just killed a guy, that's why I'm running. Detect me, bro. No need to detect me. Holy fuck, that worked. Who's done this? Tell me. Oh. Do not get detected, Tyler. Do not get detected. You are a lucky man. You are alive, and I am still in Akka. Here is what I have to tell you. The only thing more dangerous than a drunken sailor is one who is also angry. I know it does not seem like much, but with your wisdom, I am sure it will help. Okay. Drunken sailors populate the docks. Cool. Thanks, bro. Uh. One last investigation point, and it's an easy it's one. Worse. His paranoia knows no bounds. He's doubled our shifts. No one sleeps. Wasn't so bad till he decided to make the port his home. He's planning something to see. That's why he came here. Planning what? What's the meaning of this? The two of you off in a corner, whispering, plotting? Nothing of the sort. We were only... Only what? What secrets are you keeping? You misunderstand. Damned assassins, they're probably here right now, watching us. Do you find this amusing? Do you? Well, laugh while you can. Double the patrols. Which ones? All of them. But we don't have the men. Find them. Recall our knights from the field if you must. There's a target. Why can't I just kill him now? Uh, the whole now's not the time. We need to pick our timing. Let me just fucking kill him and get it done. 
A lame French legless. Greetings, brother. How fares your search? Done. I learned all there is to know about my target. Totally. Share your knowledge with me then. Sabrand is said to be consumed by fear, driven mad by the knowledge that his death approaches. He has sealed the docks district and now hides within waiting for his ship to arrive. This will make things dangerous. I wonder how it is he learned of your mission. The men I've killed, they are all connected. Al Muallam warned me that word of my deeds has spread among them. Be on your guard, Altair. <clears throat> he won't need to be paranoid anymore. Of course, Rafiq. But I think it will be to my advantage. Fear will weaken him. Time to put his stress to rest. Let's do this. And get the fuck out of this disgusting city. What have I done? You bastard! You know that! You fucking know that, bastard! Some nice patrols going on right now. Let's finish where we started. Oh shit. There he is. You are mistaken, Master Sibrand. I would never propose violence against any man, and, and most certainly not against you. So you say, and yet no one here will vouch for you. What am I to make of this? I, I live a simple life, my lord, as do all men of the cloth. It is not for us to call attention to ourselves. Perhaps. Or perhaps they do not know you because you are not a man of God, but an assassin! Never! <laughs> If they cover themselves as we do, it is only to instill uncertainty and fear. You must not give in. Are you calling me a coward? Challenging my authority? Are you perhaps hoping to turn my own knights against me? No, this no, guy no, is no. fucking I, I insane. Why are you <laughs> doing this to me? I've done nothing wrong. <laughs> I don't recall accusing you of any wrongdoing, which makes your outburst rather odd. What? Is it the presence of guilt that compels a confession? But I confess nothing. Ah, defiant to the very end. What the what fuck? Mean? This guy is insane. William and Garnier were too confident. And they paid for this with their lives. I won't make the same mistake. If you truly are a man of God, then truly the Creator will provide for you. Let him stay my hand. You've gone mad. Yes, he but has. None of you come forward to stop this. He is clearly poisoned by his own fear, compelled to see enemies where none exist. I'd help you, bro, but the game won't let me right now. It seems the people share. Like I literally concern. can't move any further than that guy. What I do, I do for Arkle. Stay vigilant, men. Report any suspicious activity to the guard. I doubt we've seen the last of these assassins. Persistent bastards. Now get back to work. <laughs> this guy's so fucking crazy. I love it. I'm gonna just destroy him. So he's getting on that boat. Oh, can't fall in the water. Oh, that was close. So he's gone to the main ship, I believe. Hmm. Why? No. 
<laughs> He's screaming at his ship. This guy's fucked. I'm gonna destroy this guy. Okay, well this time, an actual assassin's come for you. Fuck off. Go to sleep, my precious. Go to sleep. Please, don't, don't be scared. You are afraid. Of course I am afraid. But you'll be safe now, held in the arms of your god. Have my brothers taught you nothing? I know what waits for me. For all of us. If not your god, then what? Nothing. Nothing waits. And that is what I fear. You don't believe. How could I, given what I know? What I've seen? Our treasure was the proof. Proof of what? That this life is all we have. Linger a while longer, then. And tell me of the part you were to play. A blockade by sea to keep the fool kings and queens from sending reinforcements once we... once we... Conquered the Holy Land? Freed it, you fool. From the tyranny of faith. Freedom? You worked to overthrow cities, control men's minds, murdered any who spoke against you. I followed my orders, believing in my cause. Same as you. Maybe more complicated than you know, I'll tell you. It's not always quite that simple. Okay, guys. It's been great. I mean, I've loved Acre every second of it. It's been a great city to me. Always full of fun times. But I'm leaving right fucking now. Boop. I'm just gonna go around ya. That's cool. Oh, let me out of this place. Altair. You've caused quite a stir. I've done as requested. Sabran's life is ended. So it is. So it is. You should ride for Masiaf and inform Al Muallim of your success. Yes. I should return and speak to him. Of this and other things. Is everything all right, my friend? You seem distant. It's nothing, Rafiq. Just a lot on my mind. Talk to me then. Let me help. I need to make sense of this myself first. But thank you for the offer. It is the men you kill, isn't it? You feel something for them. How? Ah, my friend. You are not meant to enjoy these grim tasks. Regret, uncertainty, sympathy. This is to be expected. I should not fear these feelings. You should embrace them. They are what keep you human. What if I'm wrong? What if these men are not meant to die? What if they mean well? Misguided, perhaps? but pure in motive. I am but a Rafiq, Altair, and such things are beyond me. Perhaps Al Mualim can help you to make sense of it. Yes, perhaps. Thank you, Rafiq. It is my pleasure to have served with one as skilled as you. Strange, very strange. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. <sighs> Another target. We've destroyed that super lame legless. French legless. And now we return to Masyaf. But first, I think we leave the Animus. Modern day part! Awesome! The Wherever fuck's going on? Time to retrieve it. Working on it. And when it's done. He'll be taken care of. I want that progress report by tomorrow morning. I've got some work I need to do. So you've got the rest of the night to yourself. Um, okay. But we're so close!
and so Vidic disappears with magic. So, Lucy, wanna bang? I think there's a problem with the Animus. Nope, it's working fine. I'm pretty sure it just ejected me I'm when I- I'm pretty sure you should shut up. You ready to finally tell me what's going on? We have to stop them, Desmond. When they access that last memory of yours, they're just getting started. They want to change everything. The way we live, the way we think, the way we are. You've gotten the lecture from Vidic about what's wrong with the world, how we need order and discipline, so they're going to give it to us. Only we don't have a say in the matter. How? The Templar treasure. They think it... Miss Dilma, I'm here. I need you to upload Desmond's files to the database. Got it. Lucy, you are mid-sentence. So what? You're using me to find this Templar treasure? What do they call it? The Peace of Eden? Well, it's looking like it's at Messiah. So I don't know why they're wasting all this time with me. Why don't they just send their people to pick it up? They can't. It's not that simple. The artifact from Messiah, they had it. It was destroyed in the accident. Then what are they hoping for me, you know, for my ancestor, to tell them? They're hoping he'll show them where the other ones are. You mean there's more than one of these things? Oh, Desmond, you have no idea. Is there a problem, Mr. No, Warren. Everything's Denver on my end. Then I've got to move these files before he gets suspicious. We'll talk more later. Okay then, well, um, I'm gonna go sleep, I guess. With your cryptic, deceitful lies, Lucy. I'll get you one day. I'll get you one day. But now it's time for night-night. <laughs>